Good early morning, everybody. Clint from State Parkers here. I just want to show you what I just woke up to. I would call this the uh, the first light of the day. Well, we're up. Nice little camp spot this time. Pernalis Falls State Park campsite number 39. We have a little grill here, we got a fire grill there, picnic table, perfect spot back there to hang a couple hammocks like we did last night. A little path that way, probably goes right down to the creek, or to the river. Moon, sun, interesting. <laughs> Go ahead. Side of the river that we have not seen still. Every time as we come here, we keep realizing that there's just so much to this place, it's not even a map. Looks like this is perfectly set up for a little miniature civilization. We gotta go up this rock and over the other side. Okay. Ready? Ready. Okay, just to uh, just to be clear, we're out in the middle of the riverbed here at Pernanales Falls State Park. It's really beautiful. It's a great day. There's not a cloud in the sky. It feels like it's about 80 degrees. It feels good. Um, one thing that you cannot do when you're out here, you can't really cross the river and hang out on the other side of the banks because it's other other people's property. Bye. 
boulder whacker. This is a really fun thing to do. Come out to Cornelhouse Falls and see how far up the river you can walk. Kenneth Cram. That's K R. A -M -M. He's got a video on YouTube that shows the Pertinalis Falls in full flash flood action. So check that out if you want to see how dangerous it really can be. You're not supposed to wade or walk in this water, so don't do it. Melody just made it across. Seemingly no problem. It's my turn now. The weather's perfect today. My seat is perfect. Why don't you have a seat with me? Just an amazing place. Very serene, very peaceful. found a trail. I knew we would. Drop my headwear. <laughs> We're gonna go up all this path, take a left, and go up hiker style. <laughs> What just happened? <laughs> Nothing. I freaked out because I thought I had a spider on me. <laughs> this has been a lovely morning into the midday. It's about 2.30 right now. We're going to go back to the campsite and uh, gather a few little things. Get them ready. we got to go into Austin tonight. So, gather a few things before we Head away for a little while, then we'll come back, get some more footage. Something. 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 Well, that wraps it up for our little Pertinalis Falls River exploration. I'd say it went very well, and I can't wait to do it again. They got gunk machine, man. Why not? Nature really gives back to you when you let it. We want to we wanna spread the joy. So let us spread the joy. We're here at the Real Rock presentation and I just want to show you the booth of, of stuff that we have set up to display. We're doing a raffle. Real Rock 9, Valley Uprising, famous climbers, um, Arcteryx, Patagonia, Patagonia, got some good stuff, got some climbing equipment, some water filters, a Thermarest, charger, you know, various items that Backwoods sells, jackets, really nice stuff, Arcteryx, Cliff Bar is here, they're over the way, Climb Tech is behind us, and uh, 
We are in the Stateside Theater. This ought to be a good night. Hundreds of pages of information on the These guys are crossed some sort of freaking line in trying to bring Chongo Chuck to justice. Well, that was real rock. Since we plan on trying to do a little night hiking tonight, we're gonna make dinner really easy so we can cook it quick. So I'm thinking we're gonna go with cheeseburgers. We're heading back to camp. See what's up. dinner tonight. Cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers. Cheese. And cap off the evening, we'll put out our fire. Morning, everybody. We've just packed up our stuff for the most part, and we're getting ready to head on to the house. If you are camping and it is just you and your child, by all means, bring your child everywhere you go, even if you get up early in the morning and he's still asleep. Wake him up and take him with you. Mm -hmm. 